staff are really always compassionate. Um, if you're having issues, you can go to speak to them, um, specifically Julia. She's very inclusive and she understands when you're having an issue. You're not pigeonholed after your degree. And that was a big selling point for me that it felt like it was opening many doors instead of if I'd done my original plan of a history degree, which was one or two routes. So that was a big selling point for this specific uni and this course. You doing charades a few weeks ago yeah, was, was great. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> that was yeah. great. Yeah. Start, 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 start of a lecture, start of a seminar. Yeah. yeah. That was great. You gave me a really hard one. I can't remember what it was, but. Yeah, calendar girls, and I had no idea how to do it, and you're just like, yeah, do it. <laughs> I was just like... But why was it, why, do you remember why we did charades? Oh, it was because sometimes it's hard for people to understand what you mean when you're, when you're not able to talk, it's sometimes difficult to get your point across, so... But also we're looking at how uh, the semantics, the meaning of words, and yeah. all how words are built, so we're breaking down to syllables and phonics. Yeah. So we had to do a... Um, I'm glad you didn't do too much in Cullingfield. <laughs>